In this video, we will see how to use the concentric mate and parallel mate in SOLIDWORKS. I have already imported these two parts and now click on mate. And under the category of the standard mate, we have concentric mate. This one. Click on this concentric mate. And now let's select this circle of this part and this circle of the other part and we have this concentric mate we can flip the direction by using this button okay and now simply check the box here you can see uh, the faces of these two parts are still not in correct position so if i want to do this then select this parallel mate select this face and select this face of the other part and here you can see now these faces have become parallel so that's how we use the parallel mate and concentric mate in solidworks both of the part become concentric and uh, the faces of uh, both part have become parallel with respect to each other so that's how we use them